And today's fun fact for you today, kiddies, is... Did you know in the... Like, you know whenever you hit up a game on your Steam library, it's like all the stuff like your achievements, your hopes, your dreams, your screenshots, your achievements, your other stuff. You know the bit where it says, like, up latest news about this game? Yeah, the latest news about this game, by the way, is one, this game sucks, but you don't need to do that because I have hammered that point home far too many times now. Um, no, the other bit of news was, don't miss out on the fun, this game is on sale. And why would you ever want to miss out on the fun this game provides? Fun, 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 fun. Fun! Anyway, what we're we doing, busy work is what we're doing, because the game just doesn't have the guts to let me do the final boss yet. No, we need to go and get the magical MacGuffin of bullshit that will allow me to kill the final boss once and for all. So the next bit we need is up north, there's stuff in the way, probably more jab of the swamp monsters, so... Yeah, just jab of the... These ones have holes in their faces, by the way, so they're more like, I don't know... Dex is diner if Dex wore an eye patch if he was like trying to be more badass. Because you know it's me old buddy. But hey, what do you know? For now I'm just gonna kill these guys. Anyway, I'm killing them with whatever I feel like killing them with, because to be honest, I've already forgotten what they'll like like in a week or two, I just remembered, but Yeah. What's more, I feel like oh by the way, this guy's weak to wind and lightning. The other the uh, jab of a swamps though uh Week to not win. Oh well, we'll zap him to death with lightning, by the way. This is like the first time you've ever been useful, Serum or Usimaki, or whatever you want to call your name. Are you ever going to get a haircut, by the way? I swear to God, he doesn't wash his hair. Seriously, it looks ugly. Also, maybe he needs to wash that shitty green paint off his face at some point, because it's, it's embarrassing. Anyway, um, I probably should do a group heal, by the way, because these two are already dying, so uh, have a group heal on me. On the house. Yeah. Done. And the snake's nearly dead at least. And the other guys are dying, so that's good. And this guy's already back. Oh, wait, now he's fucked. Yeah, the snake's probably gonna bite him in the next turn, isn't it? Um. Well, since you get to move before everyone else. Well, you don't get to move before everyone else, but. You can take care of your own healing, because if I send someone else to do the healing, they'll just end up healing themselves when it inevitably fucks up, because you. You're fucked. You're gonna get killed in a minute. I just, I, I, I can sense it. Oh, it didn't happen. Odd. Usually I'm right, but okay, whatever. He's gonna die, bro. Even with his stupid demon armor, he's gonna get fucked. Well, because of all the fucking emo eyeshadow he's wearing. I, I, I hope at one point, he, you know, you know when you go to sleep sometimes, you rest your head on your shoulders. Yeah, I hope he fucking does that and impales himself on his shoulder pads. Yeah, I don't care. I just now have genuine hatred for him now, ish. Oh. Well, not genuine, it's just more me lashing out out of, like, I don't know, spitting fire, blood, boredom, whatever. But we won the fight, by the way. And he leveled up, but it doesn't count because he already has his ultimate, so, um... Whoopity doopity. Anyone up for any upgrades at this point in the game that they would like to have? Or, actually, you know what, I'll just go on my... Oh, there's another bonus boss fight to do, actually. And we'll see if this one's as bullshit hard as Cthulhu. The guy who has no right to be in this game, but whatever. I should change this guy, by the way. I'm gonna get the. Uh, yeah, I'm actually gonna change my pet for once. Um, get a friendly ghost, I guess. A friendly ghost would be useful. The ghost is with the mostest. Who I'm leveling up. There we go. It's a level 5 ghost now. Right, anyway, another fight is ahead of us. I'll just quickly check for upgrades because I might as well spam them out. Uh, I'm guessing the next weapon we're getting, by the way, is. Yeah, good chaos start. It's gonna be called the Jagged Edge. Sounds really fucking stupid. Uh, oh, by the way, you can have your stone golem armor, by the way. Let's see how annoying it looks. I mean, you're not joining the party ever again, but... Does it look retarded? Wow, it's like the first ever sensible armor in this game. I don't even get to laugh at it, which I feel is, like, is disappointing. Oh, well, whatever. He's still not joining the party. He is completely useless. Um, but yeah, there's nothing that I need to upgrade. Right, fine. Carry on. Here's another battle. We're against three Jabba the Hutts. Well, let it be said that they always like to up the stakes in this game, don't they? Right, 
we know what to do. Spam out all the lightning we have because literally at this point since it's just snakes we actually get the first move every time so yeah we're pretty much dealt with for healing now aren't we? Um, I mean yeah I mean look you just quickly knock your health back up because you're at half health. You just spray out some more lightning and as for you you need to heal up as well because you're dying as well so yeah, done. Simple as a pimple really isn't it? Are pimple simple though? I don't know. They simply form whenever it's le least convenient for me. Usually on photo day. So you've got to give it a big old squeeze. Yes this conversation is now becoming incredibly disgusting but hey pimples are there to be squashed and slumbered. That's what you do with them. By the way, can you just quickly heal up Usa Maka Waka Shaka Laka Maka? Thank you. Oh, by the way, I accidentally put the wrong attack on, but he's. Oh, well, it was just. Actually, I made him wet, so I comboed him with lightning, so he got absolutely wrecked, and now he's actually about to get wrecked anyway. Uh, well, you could be responsible for your own healing in case the game just kills you anyway, so. Yeah, enjoy healing yourself. As for you, I know you are. Fuck it, just heal yourself because you're dying as well now, aren't you? There we go. It's like my bonus insurance policy. And luckily the game was kind for once and it'll kill you instantly. Except now you're dying again anyway, so uh, welcome to the world of healing yourself again. As for you... Oh wait, shit, who died to make heal themselves? Oh, I can't remember. Oh wait, I haven't chosen who's healing yet. Heal yourself, there you go. I think I just phased out of reality for two seconds because, I don't know, I must have transcended the realms of utter boredom once more. I really do moan too much. I really should have put down on the moaning, but then again I say that and it never happens. And it never will as well. Oh well. Soon I get to write the review for this game. And this game won't score low, by the way. I, 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 this game will probably literally probably get a 50 out of 100. Competent, but boring is what I will say because that is really what you can say. Competent, but boring. And even then, the competency is in question. Anyway, what's the bonus boss fight? What's the crap story behind it? This is called Abomination Encounter. The swamp around you begins to gurgle profusely. Suddenly, without warning, you are attacked by a hulking abomination. It is a swamp monster that reeks of rotting flesh and decay. Thank you for the definition. How stupid does it look? Pretty fucking stupid. And it has a fetish for red spikes, and I can't tell which leg is which and why it's all disjointed. It looks, it looks like it's going to fall apart any minute. Anyway, if it's like swamp monsters we've already met, then I am assuming the swamp monster will be swamp head or swamp dead by Messi lightning all around so um yeah just lightning his shit up please and if he's if you want oh wait oh wait he gets to go first actually so um yep we broke the boss fight in the good way you know what i mean i get to win now basically was the lightning effective or ineffective by the way i wasn't paying attention yeah, it's somewhat effective i'm guessing it's not his weakness though Oh, and he can spit poison, by the way. Strong poison, apparently. Right, well... There's no point in you doing a group heal, because once more, the game will just, like, poison us after we've healed, so just heal. Just heal Captain Dickhead for now. Um, try and set fire to him, by the way. I'm not wasting time on inspections. I will just hit him with whatever I want. Just guess. It isn't light, but I don't know. That was a really big effort. Did he like, have an actual giant shit coming out of his ass? By the way, I swear to God, he did. Uh, right, by the way, you're on healing duty for the rest of your life. Uso Siramaka. Uh, have we tried setting fire to him yet? Try and set fire to him. Fire's always useful. Can you just keep summoning down the big angel piece? He does a half decent. Oh, actually, it critted him, so he yeah, does a decent amount of damage. There we go. And yeah, she's, she's getting. I'm actually going to get quite up, but oh, right, whatever, right. Uh, heal her back up, please, because I don't want her dying on me. Make him bleed out. Make her down demons or whatever, right. I don't know why I keep string up. She died anyway. 
And, oh, by the way, he can summon down uh, giant swords from the sky, apparently, because, yeah, magical swamp dogs can do that. I'll give this guy a little go, actually, even. Uh, yeah, by the way, that is really fucking annoying, how he can just basically summon down a tactical nuke from the sky. Fine, second attempt, because you know what, I got down quite a bit of his health, and I was just being lazy with it, so, yeah, just give him one more go, and we'll see what happens, and then I guess there's more busy work to be done, because, yay, busy work is so much fun. Right, um, right, just zap his shit up again. Actually, you know what, just fucking, right, we'll do this the proper way, examine him, find out what he's weak to. At least you don't like have an examined skill. You just instantly know how to ruin this guy's shit with a magical magnifying glass. Fire and earth will wipe this guy out. Okay, cool. Also, he still has that bad habit, habit of summoning giant swords. Oh, by the way, he goes last still, I think. Um, I didn't say his name. Captain Crap. He goes last. He literally sucks. Like, he, he honestly sucks so hard right now, doesn't he? Anyway, we want to be spraying out the big old earth attacks, so... Earthquakes... Heal him up, though. Um, and then... Oh, wait, who did I make do the healing? You are not doing the healing if you move last, matey boy. You don't really have any earth attacks, but he didn't like fire, so go and set fire to him. As for you, I want you to heal up the wizard, because wizardy boy needs healing again. Imagine if Mountain Blade had magic by way, would that be cool or would that be crap? I don't know. Oh, by the way, now, now that we actually reduce his... Oh dear, he's summoned a tactical nuke again. Now that we've reduced his agility, you actually get to have a go. You must feel so special about that. Uh, right, uh, there's literally nothing you can do about just keep on tanking those uh, swords by the way, which keep falling from the sky to murder you. You switch to your stone demon spirit thing by the way, there we go. Stone I guess we're taking him down slowly. What's he going to do by the way? Oh, another tactical sword you guessed, right? Heal yourself back up. As for you, you're getting quite low on health, so you know what, you just do a heal on yourself as well today. And you just go and basically smack him and smack him up. Yeah, that's not a bad amount of damage there. If we crit him, we will probably do even more damage, because that is how critical attacks work, by the way, if you did not know. I hope you enjoyed that very brief and very pointless lesson, which I have just bestowed upon you. And I suspect this is going to be another one of those boss fights I'm just going to fast forward, because once more, there is nothing really to engage in these boss fights, apart from the fact they just take forever. Which, as we all know, is completely not engaging at all, unless it like had multiple phases and really cool music. Apart from this, a really annoying ear-splitting music loop, which it is probably slowly grazing itself into my brain once more. And uh, just say, even the final boss of Sonic Force was better. And that thing took me half an hour to beat, by the way, which is something that's actually quite bad to admit. But the only reason it took half an hour to beat him was because the homing attack fucked up on me because again, fucking bugged out. It legit bugged out by where I actually put homing attack for some reason, so it made the boss fight take forever. But like even at least that fight was kinda cool. The music was cool. It just wouldn't be better cool if the rest of the game was actually good instead of well, bad. By the way, he's stuck in a vicious cycle of healing all the time. Please feel sorry for him. Now, please feel sorry for me now. Like, you get to at least see the fast forwarded version. I have to play the real time version. See you in a few minutes, my friends. Right, he's dead. I get my achievement, and at least now I just get to basically steal all this stuff. So I got a cursed soul, which looks like something out of. Candy Crush, a Poison Gland, and some Dark Horns. Right, what can I use them for then? What free shit did I win today? I didn't really get anything for this guy. By the way, we never unlocked the legendary armor. Not that I care. Um, didn't really get anything. What do you need to arc? You need Static Stone, by the way, for Arcane Bows. Not that I care once more. Uh, we don't even get all this forbidden stuff, by the way. Need forbidden matter for that. This is stupid. Um, did I like not get? Oh wait, we can craft berserker armor. Fine. Let's see how 
Do, is it once more? Does it, is it like absolutely nothing, or is it actual armor for one? It is absolutely nothing. Seriously. Then again, once more, Krung is probably actually the most neglected character in my entire part, but you can have a robe of fawns. Does it look really stupid? <laughs> oh, he must think he's so hard wearing that when in reality he looks like an absolute dick. And you get the mythic robe as well, but to be honest, you just you're, you're just literally an <laughs> oh, you're gonna be doing all the assassinating that dress like a fucking Japanese wank lord, which doesn't even make any sense as an insult. It's probably more of a racism thing there, but whatever. And you can have your stupid poison down. You look so stupid. Like, seriously, what the fuck is that? I mean, I mean yeah, stealthy! Oh, well, whatever. It might work if he somehow gets him. Uh, what's that game called? White and red, what is it? Edge or. Mirror, mirror edge. That's it. Yeah, it might work there. You blend him with all the set dressing, but for now he isn't. Anyway, here's another battle. I'm, I'm, I'm just saying, fuck okay, it. Let's just get that last bit of busy work done before I end this episode, because well, this is the last episode I'm going to record for this cycle because I have reached my tolerance level now for this game, and therefore I want to go and play something else. I am slated to record SimCity 3000, but actually I've got to do some more Road Total War. But SimCity 3000 is next on my list for this cycle, so yay! Oh, SimCity 3000. There is a god. Barely. Uh, by the way, you just do a lightning attack, you just do your lightning attack, and as for you, can you just heal up the wizard again because he's so pathetic? His health is all up where he died, because snakes go first, I forgot. So she went and healed up someone who didn't really need healing anyway. Life is sweet. Oh, well, at least someone's stunned by where I don't know who, and neither do I care. Right, just beat people up then. That's all we can do is everyone fucking slides across the air hockey battleground, which is what we'll just refer to it as now. Because this is like air hockey shit posting. Uh, I think shit posting these days, isn't it? Uh, could you try and heal him by the way, but you probably won't because these snakes always get the first move, told you so. Snakes always have initiative, because fuck you. Right, uh, I say do an attack move, but let's face it, I think this entire battle's about to blow up in my face. Not that I really, yeah, the entire battle's fucking blowing up in my face. One Evs. I'm out, dudes. I'll just do it again. I've paid the fine. I've done the crime. Not that there was a crime. Uh, so now we'll just go and do it again. And again. And again. Because that is a definition of insanity, apparently, according to some internet philosopher or whatever. Still, it's just this fight, and then I get to go all the way to Bloodlust Caverns. Oh, by the way, it's Jabba the Tree again. Anyway, can we just wipe out the snake first? Because the snake is the one who's going to be the one who is most in the way of what I'm trying to do. Stupid fucking carnival snake. Seriously, it does look like it's supposed to be in a fucking carnival, like on a balloon or something. The snake actually looks like a I, I, I swear to God, the snake's had like a full frontal lobotomy or something, because it's... It's just a hi. What am I doing here? That's literally all the snake is doing. The snake has no self-awareness whatsoever, sadly. Please heal yourself up, by the way, because you are about to get fucked. Told you. Oh well, you got to heal yourself up this time, despite the fact you are currently on fire. But everyone's still element weak to lightning, at least, and Jabba the Nut hates you. Right. Um. Yeah, you finish off the snake, by the way, you just keep on working, and you just keep on healing yourself up, because I'm now in the vicious cycle of healing again, aren't I? Yes, sir! Oh, well, the snake is dead, at least, and these two are dying, which is always good to know, but then again, she is still dying. Uh, right, you two just start working on the big sluggos, the slugger nuggers. You just keep on healing yourself up because your life has literally devolved into that, hasn't it? Yes, it has. There we go. Right, just one left to go now. One left to go. You know, if the final boss is after this fight, well, like after I've got those two things, I might just end this game. Like, you know, like do another episode, just end it all. But I don't trust this game, so I probably won't. I just don't trust this game with the amount of time it's already dragged itself out. It just, it just won't do that again. By the way, why are we always doing these battles like within earshot of like a village or something? Oh wait, I forgot we only have one background per zone, don't we? Because yeah. 
I know other games which have pulled that shit as well, like Grand Kingdoms, but oh well. But then again, Grand Kingdoms has genuine effort and really good artwork and that, doesn't it? Anyway, here's some other stuff we found. Let's just go in and watch some terrible dialogue. You enter the bloodless caverns. Wizard who changes his name all the time, because apparently it's legal according to him, leads the way and disables all the protective barriers put in place to steal away the Chaos Stone Orb, because, yeah. Uh, we could come up, we could we could have put in a thrilling action scene at this point to watch them get disabled, but remember we are on like the level of like a, a fucking year five playground. Um, but yeah, anyone who tried to mine it like died, and but since Deus Ex Siren or whatever, he just knew about it because he's fucking the best. Um, by the way, we harvested it and we exited it, but yeah, someone got in the way. Demon came in and said, Fee five fur fum, I'm just a bigger version of him, I have a... By the way, apparently, yeah, he's aware of Thanatos, what's more of a guy who I swear to god I've heard of before. Yeah, he knows what we're up to, so what he did was he slightly scaled up the big guy version of his regular demon guy. I swear to god some of his stuff looks like he's scribbled on. Oh well, fine. By the way, you won't get the chance to forge it because he sent out the, the big guy. Oh wait, the big guy got two friends as well. So it's the big guy with some big backup. Bad witch. Right, anyway, Earthquake and uh, Holy Light Uh You know, take out the Assassin dude first because I can already tell you from, from like, looking at him, he's going to get a pain in the horrors. Oh wait, the wizard gets to go first, and now she's been frozen, but oh well, I critted one with an earthquake, and the earthquake did do the intended thing by way of the, Oh, wow, you just got punched in the face by a demon. You got clocked by him, but to be honest, it isn't funny, because the animations just never... Well, they do sync up in a way, but to be honest, that's why they're never very thrilling to watch. It's like, you know... By the way, you just got stabbed by ice, and I can hit her, and now you can also you're dead. Not that I care. Not that I care, not that I care at all Because I generally don't, not one bit You know what, I've lost this fight by the way and I think this is where I'm actually going to call it a day Because as you can tell, this is one of those fights that is going to be an absolute arse for Ghana to, to take down So you know what, next time we'll do this fight and I'll be back and I'll be refreshed Because I'm going to call it a night entirely for recording stuff, so yeah Next time I'll be back, I'll be fresh, and I'll be ready to deal with this, because right now, I ain't just in that mood. Because, well, whenever am I in the mood? The answer is, never. But again, I guess I could bring back Captain Assassin, who, I know he's got his, he's got his arm, which he thinks is special. But, you know, I can still use that silly, I will just heal myself up all the time attack, so. Yeah, he gets to come back into the party for now. So we'll use him next time, but for now, well, have a nice evening, folks. See you later.